Hello, hello, hello. I guess that's my, uh, I guess that's my thing now. I guess that's my theme. Hello, hello, hello. <laughs> guess I do it all the time. Somebody pointed that. Uh, somebody pointed my, uh, my ways out to me. Uh, I didn't think about it, but um, God has been um, speaking to me. And he's. Um, I want to tell you this. I want to tell you this right here. Um, there is coming a out, great outpouring of the presence of God. That's coming. That's coming. As a matter of fact, it's trickling down now. And um, I will say this right here for those of you that have been asking for and you've been believing and uh, been, you've been you've been praying over and over about receiving, receiving, receiving. Well, uh, you're about to receive. You're about to receive his presence because you need it, because you need it. And, and so one of the things that I've, uh, I, I, I've noticed is that uh, um, for about a week, for about a week, uh, there was some white doves. Wherever I went, wherever I went, everywhere I go, I would look and I would notice, and actually my wife would notice it too, there would be uh, white doves. And, uh, and one of the things that, 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 that God has been speaking to me is that his presence and, and his Holy Spirit, his Holy Spirit is coming down because that white dove is a sign that represents the presence of God. It represents the Holy Ghost. It, re it represents that. It represents that. And so uh, there's a presence. There's a presence of God's Holy Spirit uh, that ha that that's been released even in a uh, uh, even in a greater way. And, and the reason why the anointing, his presence, has has been released even in a greater way, it is because the people, the people hearts, the people hearts are changing. The people hearts are, are becoming even more, more more kind. The people hearts are becoming even more excited. And so when when hearts when when hearts are conducive, when hearts are right. When hearts are ready for change, when hearts are ready to, for healing, when hearts are, are ready uh, for that next level, then that's when God will and can come in. My, let me tell you though, let me tell you though, when, when you feel God's presence, let me tell you what to do. When you feel God's presence, uh, and it's gonna be a sensation that you've never felt before, He's gonna come in a way, He's gonna come in a way that you've never felt before. And so when He comes, don't resist. When the presence of God touches you and when the presence of God talks to you or rests upon you, do not resist. And as a matter of fact, when he rests upon you, uh, just say, God, I receive. Just say, God, I receive. God, I receive. God, I receive. As a matter of fact, I'm going to speak it out myself. Receive the Holy Ghost. Those that, those that have been praying for it, those that have been asking for it, those that have been crying out and saying, God, I need it. God, I need it. And you do. You do, you do for in this time and this season. And, and, and right now, I speak. I speak the Holy Ghost. Be filled with the Holy Ghost right now in the name of Jesus. I speak. I speak. I speak. I speak the Holy Ghost into your mind. I speak the Holy Ghost into your existence. I speak the Holy Ghost into your heart. I speak the Holy Ghost to come into your mouth and get down into your spirit, man, and be ye filled in Jesus' name. And one of the things that, that I notice also, I notice also that one of the things that God is doing in concerning languages, what God is doing is concerning languages. What God is doing, God is taking many languages. God is taking many languages and he's making those languages one. He's taking many languages, he's making them one. He's making one voice, one voice, one voice. And so watch, 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 and watch. This will come up suddenly. Hear what I'm saying. God is about to release. God is about to release. God is about to, God, God is about to let go of. Uh, God is about to, God, God, God is about to set free. Um, uh, God is about to awaken. God is about to awaken another refreshing. He's about to awaken uh, uh, his, his anointing. He's about to awaken, he's about to awaken, uh, he's about to awaken gifts. He's about to awaken understanding. He's about to awaken wisdom. He's about to awaken joy. He's about to awaken uh, breakthroughs. God is awakening. God is awakening those things that are down, those things that are bound in your spirit, man. That's been bound for many, many years because of because of depression, because of whatever it was, whatever it was that caused that thing in you, that that gift, that 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 anointing, that power that God had gave you to help, that gave you to deliver. You laid it down because of a situation, but God is causing that thing. He's speaking to that situation. He's speaking that hurt place. He's speaking to that hurt place and he's saying, come on and rise. Arise, 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 rise. For master, the master has need for you. For wake up, wake up, wake up. For God is calling you. God is calling you. For God said in the word that my sheep know my voice. And a stranger they won't follow. So God is calling. God is calling. God is calling. And so there's gonna come an activation. There's gonna come a move. There's gonna come a move. There's gonna come a rush. And so God is gonna speak to you. And, and he's gonna shake. God's gonna be in a shaking. God's gonna begin to shake the land. He's going to be in the shake the land with, with anointing, with the anointing. He's going to be in the shake the land uh, with the essence of his presence, his aroma, his atmosphere. His atmosphere is permeating the, the, the atmosphere. 
his, his, his atmosphere is permeating the land. And so what now is doing, God is, God is forming. He's forming. What he's forming, I'll tell you what he's forming. He is forming a thick cloud. He is coming. He's coming. He's coming in a thick cloud. He's not going to come in a shallow cloud, but he's coming in a thick cloud. And when he's coming in a thick, thick cloud, he's coming, passing out gifts. He's filling. He's filling. But not only he's filling, he's refilling. He's re-anointing. He's re-signing. He's re-anewing. He's reappointing. This is the moment and this is the hour where God is turning, appointing, and anointing for such a time as this. And he's filling. In Jesus' name, amen and amen.